We want to resolve this issue. But you know what experience has taught us with this government? They would meet with an organization and ensure that they satisfy one aspect and then that organization goes quiet. And that is why all of these things that have been festering in our country continues to fester simply because individuals, organizations have not taken the stand that BNTU has taken. The BNTU has a constitution that governs how it operates. We are a democratic organization. No one person dictates to BNTU how it will move. Our constitution does that. Our council will be meeting on Saturday again. Because it's a democratic organization, we will listen to what direction they give us. But for the minister to come and try to stronghold the BNTU, because if you read what he said yesterday, he said, I insist on my position, they don't want to move, so he is insistent on his position. Our council so far is insistent on our position. And this is not trying to disrespect anybody. There is a process. And we are prepared to continue to follow that process because we must maintain the integrity of the Belize National Teachers Union.